Scientists across the world are racing against time to develop a vaccine for COVID-19. And now it seems that the trial at Oxford University has crossed a major milestone in this direction. Sarah Gilbert, professor of vaccinology at the university, has said that a potential vaccine has shown encouraging results. Jill Bert is uh, one of the leading scientists behind Oxford's efforts to develop a vaccine. While speaking at a parliamentary hearing, Gilbert said that trials for a vaccine candidate named AZD1222 has, quote-unquote, shown the right sort of immune response. <laughs> this is one of the few positive statements to have come in the grim times, and one which raises great hope. The vaccine will now enter phase three of the trials. As per Gilbert, some 8,000 volunteers have registered for phase three trials, which is a sizable number for the third phase of clinical trials for this potential vaccine. Now, Gilbert, however, stopped short of giving a time estimate as to when the vaccine will be ready. But if all goes well in the trials, this could be the first vaccine against the coronavirus. While the Oxford trial has certainly raised hopes, it is not the only institution working towards making a vaccine. According to the World Health Organization, there are 16 vaccine candidates currently in late-stage clinical trials among the 114 vaccines in different stages of development to fight the Wuhan virus. Of these 16 vaccine candidates, five are being researched in China, three in the United States of America, two in United Kingdom and one each in Australia, Germany and Russia. But the big question is, how far away is a coronavirus vaccine? And what's the status of the trials? According to the latest reports, American biotech company Moderna, which has begun phase two trials for its vaccine, has collaborated with drug maker, with drug maker Catalan to manufacture 100 million doses starting in the third quarter of 2020. Currently, Moderna's experimental vaccine candidate is one of the front-runners in the vaccine race. Many of the drugs being developed for or being tested for COVID-19 are antivirals. This would target the virus in people who already have an infection. A COVID-19 vaccine developed by German biotech firm BioNTech and U.S. pharmaceutical giant Pfizer has shown potential and was found to be well tolerated in early stage human trials. Overall, the world is still counting on to end a pandemic that has killed more than half a million people so far.